Oh, shit. I didn't know Obito was a pimp. Shoot, he's getting his little iceberg slim on and shit like that in this chapter. Anyway, <laughs> Obito choked Naruto like he was one of his hoes. Now, you know um, Naruto was offering his hand saying, yo, let's come back together and accept your point and all that, you know, dumb shit. He choked the shit out of Naruto like he was one of his bitches or something like that. That part was funny as hell. Anyway, Naruto breaks free and we're back to flashbacks and dumb shit like that. You already know what they did. You know, here's Ren, and don't you wish you could be back with us, and, you know, all that dumb shit. After all the bullshit, Obito finally lets Naruto massage his hands, because he had a hard day's work. He said, Naruto, go ahead and get my hands massaged. Naruto massages his hands, and finally Obito gets, you know, Juby Diary and shits out all the tail beasts. That's the end of the chapter. This is going to be a short-ass review. It's the same shit from last chapter. They just the only difference is they defeated uh, Obito at the end. Um, you know, old talk no jutsu always wins. A lot of times, like any of the main villains other than Orochimaru so far, it's like we give them a good talking to and they're done uh, in terms of like Obito, uh, Madara, he, he's going to get a talk no jutsu. I know because they got to teach. Basically, all these villains, they trying to teach them a lesson. But let's talk about real life. Some people just need to get fucking murdered. Some people ain't going to learn. And Obito, it seemed like, or it seemed like the intelligent person so far that he was one of the people that, that can't learn. He came too far. Most of his life, he spent doing this. So why would he stop now? You know? So, and he was so powerful. How did they beat him in one shot? They beat him in one fucking shot. Oh, because we working as a team. You know, Nakama power up and shit like that. That didn't really work for me. So, yeah, I'll give this chapter a 2 out of 5. They came to a conclusion. Hopefully, Madara, you know, will have something better. But I think that he's going to get to talk no juicy by, uh, you know, Hashirama. Because he's one of those villains where you got to learn a lesson. He's got some kind of vendetta. he got a chip on his shoulder. You know, everybody's the same thing. Except, you know, except for Orochi Maul. But I'm guessing he probably is. He, they probably do it. And he's, for some reason, seems like he's going to the good side out the blue for no reason. I don't know yet. Maybe he's still a villain. Who knows? But so far, it seems like they're trying to make every villain to be out to to be um, somebody who's hurting the past. Not everybody's like that. Some people just want to see the city burn. Anyway, go ahead and leave your comment. Let me know what you think about this. If you like the video, go ahead and click that like button and subscribe. Anime and manga means more. Obito choking bitches out.